Michigan cell phone store was robbed at gunpoint this afternoon, just as Cairo 7 was investigating a number of similar robberies that could be related. Cairo 7's Amy Clancy is live now in Burien with these late breaking details. Amy? And Monique, within the past few minutes, I received confirmation from the King County Sheriff's Office that four young men have been arrested, possibly in connection with a robbery here this afternoon. Now, about one o'clock, the owner of this mini mart heard a commotion next door. So she ran out of her store, ran next door to this Metro PCS, and suddenly found herself looking at a handgun because this place was being robbed. He turned around and uh, he has a gun and he pointed, you know, the gun to me. He pointed the gun yeah, at you? Yeah, yeah. The owner of Jay's Mini Mart doesn't want to be identified, but spoke with Cairo 7 just minutes after being held at gunpoint. I was almost heart attack. I was really scared because, I mean, he pointed to me, the, you know, the, the gun, with the gun. Just after one this afternoon, the Metro PCS was robbed by four men wearing masks, according to the King County Sheriff's Office, whose detectives are also investigating this armed robbery of the Metro PCS in White Center on Saturday, also by four armed men with their faces covered. Witnesses at that scene told Cairo 7 workers here had guns held to their heads. And obviously our concern is somebody getting hurt, an innocent victim getting hurt or killed because of the actions of these suspects. Sergeant Abbott confirms the same four suspects may be responsible for as many as seven recent robberies in the South King County area and possibly even crimes into the city of Seattle. At today's Burien scene, a longtime Seattle Police Department robbery detective. I'm absolutely terrified. Kristen Brady is very concerned. Four armed robbers are apparently targeting the area where she works. I'm fearful to get out of my car in the morning, walk to just my office door for fear of who's out here. I want to go back and lock my door right now. Now, again, we can confirm that four suspects have been arrested, but we do not know for sure if they are the suspects in this robbery, as well as six potential other robberies. They are right now being investigated and interrogated by detectives with both the King County Sheriff's Office as well as the Seattle Police Department. As soon as we know more, we'll pass it along to you. But we'll see you again tonight at 6 o'clock for the very latest on this ongoing investigation. For now, reporting live in Burien, Amy Clancy, Cairo 7 News.